Yo, what's going on guys? Today's video is going to be the one turn EX plus setups. If you don't want to hear me ramble, you can skip to the timestamp right here to go on to the setups. But if you care to hear me ramble, then I'm going to talk about all the different setups that were used and items that were used in the video. Now, at the very beginning, the most important aspect, the first thing used is a water ship. I spoke about this in one of my videos. This is a easy way to boost your overall damage output. Even a trash grid can do okay damage with this. I highly recommend it. If you're taking DW seriously to the point where you are wondering how to one turn EX plus fast, this would be something you have regardless. I shouldn't really have to tell you that, but um, just in case you don't know about it, you know, this is something you should have. Secondly, Arc, uh, Arc Room. All right, so in this video, the moon in this video is a maxed out SR moon. What I personally recommend is at least SSRing it. If you don't have it, do note your damage is going to be lower. If yours is unbinded, as an SR unbind with no unbinds, you're only going to have that with 3% boost. So keep that in mind. If you have an SSR, you have 7%, which is higher than what I would have. And if you're really balls deep in the water, you would have a full limit break, allowing you to have that extra 10% damage. It's very crucial when it comes to one turning stuff like this in the video. Secondly, the most important thing that I would mention, like, out, like more important than the Oracle, I mean the um, Arcarum summon, and more important than a water ship, the Ultima Katana. I would I would go as far to say it's mandatory. Um, you can do you can do setups without the Ultima Katana or Ultima Blade, whatever you want to call it. But the amount of buttons you get to drop, as in you don't have to hit nearly as many buttons due to this weapon, it is so important to have. So that's my opinion. You may not have it. I will recommend getting it. Um, it's really based around you if you really want to go out there way to get it or not. If you're not going to use it, just know that you're going to have to hit more buttons because you're not using this weapon. Just keep that in mind. And uh, for the last note, um, I, I, I do have a zero button, but the zero button, I can't do it without my the moon being uh, SSR. So it won't be done. Just letting you guys know that it, you need to SSR the moon at the very bare minimum. Um, I will show the, I will show the video and stuff like that. Just letting you guys know that. Other than that, if you have any questions, leave it in the comments. I'm gonna try to timestamp each version. I did give them little witty names because you know I thought that'd be pretty funny. But um, thank you guys for watching, and I hope you enjoy. Bye.
終わり<笑>まあ当然の結果だよね。といったところです。Now, for those of you guys who made it to the end of the video, there's one thing I actually forgot to mention, and it's that, do you guys care about me making videos for Nightmare 90? Um, I thought about doing a one turn videos, but I wasn't really sure or not. I don't really think it's that important. I, I don't know how hard people farm Nightmare 90. Personally, I don't do it myself much, but if you guys care about that type of thing, do leave it in the comments and I'll try to work on it. But thank you guys for watching and goodbye.